Now, moving on to a guy who is going to be an MVP this year. Mm. Not Cody Bellinger. He's way in the past. No, no, no. But uh, Shohei Otani has told media that he is interested in a contract extension with the L.A. Angels. Holy. So, holy crap. First of all, let's take a look at what Shohei is currently making for a dude who's an ace and an MVP silver slugger. Anything, really. You can just name it. This year, he's only making five or three million, I believe it was. Three million this year. Next year, he's making 5.5 million. And then Uh in 2023, he's an arbitration. But then he hits free agency. So, yeah, contract extension's coming up. Buddy, if I am the LA Angels, you have to lock him down. If he is showing any remote interest in your team long term, you have yes. to lock him down. Yes. He's 27 years old. He is the best player in baseball right now by a sizable margin, especially yes. when you're looking at war. 8.9 war. 8.9 just nine destroying war. baseball. Destroying it, dude. If this guy has any interest in being on your team long term, which is kind of shocking to me, because you <laughs> yeah, know, right? if I'm if I'm Shohei Otani, I want to be pitching Game Seven on a crazy team because every team and their dog is going to want me. Yeah, but you know what? Hey, the dude said I love the city and I love the fans. He loves the city. He loves the fans, and he loves yeah. it so much that he's going to hit 45 home runs for you, steal 26 bags, have over 100 uh, runs scored, 99 ribbies, have an OPS of 959, and then also throw 130.1 innings pitched and amass 156 strikeouts with a 3.18 ERA along the way. Yeah. How much money is this freaking guy going to make? Too much. This guy is going, and I honestly think, he he might take a pay cut because he wants to live in L.A., but I think this man deserves to be the highest paid player in baseball. Oh, he absolutely, dude. I I think he has to be, though. I don't don't think there's any way around it. You're combining an ace... And you're combining the MVP. It's like you're combining a guy who could win Cy Young one day, one day, and then a guy who's literally about to win MVP. Yes. Like you're like what? Literally, what? literally, and and it's also too 27 years old. Like oh, this is yeah. prime time to be hitting yes. the extension market. Yes, you know, yes, yes. you can lock him down and feel very comfortable with a 10 year deal on this oh, guy. Yeah. You know, and and he's be, a tank. He's gonna last it too. And that's the thing. You know, eventually, is he still gonna be throwing 130 innings that's and doing all this like when he's 35? Probably not. I mean, we don't know. So for, maybe he literally is the best player that in would baseball be incredible. all time, so, and he's doing that, but. For me, then what I would do is I'd front load that contract because if you got to assume that, like, just like with George Springer, we didn't front load the contract, mm. but you pay him more in the years that he's supposed to do more, and then it kind of falls out, yeah. falls out the rest of the way. So I think you got to front load that contract, contract, and then as he gets older, maybe just becomes hitter only because that's what Babe Ruth did, yeah. right? You can't be a pitcher and a hitter your whole career; you're gonna die. Well, that's the thing. <laughs> if he did, he would be the best player in baseball of yes. all time ever. Do you think he will? <gasps> I mean, I, I don't know. I didn't, I didn't think that this guy <laughs> would do this. So it's like, yeah, who yeah. even knows, dude? But this guy is going to get paid like 350 plus million, I think, you know, on, oh, on, yeah, a, yeah. on a deal for that's sure. A, that's floor for yeah, me, 350 floor, at least. It's like this guy could even push like the 400 mark. Could even. Depending on the on the years yep. and that average annual value. But the average annual value is going to be like 100% over 30 million, yeah. in my opinion. Like when you're looking at contracts like Garrett Cole and Francisco Lindor, like those are like floor yeah. in yeah, my yeah, mind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I expect it to be. Because if you do better than those guys, you deserve more. And he's doing better than those guys. Like, as far in as a way, like war, you know what I mean? Absolutely. A war, yeah, right? 100%. So uh, yeah, I get more. Yes. So that's just what it is. Yes. So. And also, too, there's a whole other element that we don't even talk about with this guy is that he is literally the most marketable player in all of baseball right right you know? yeah. you know, it's babe ruth he's, he's literally he's babe, babe ruth being reborn and and, <laughs> it, and it's so clear when you look at the analytics and the numbers it's like so many japanese viewers yes. watch shohei otani yes, the do. amount of jersey sales the amount of merchandise that yep. the la angels have literally brought in from shohei otani Hell. like he practically Hell. pays for him fucking self dude we might get an otani shirt in our background literally. we're gonna we're gonna do it for like when we're talking more baseball stuff exactly. that'd be dope you know and it's like <laughs> That alone, obviously, it's not going to pay like three. Maybe it will. I don't know. <laughs> but it's like just having that and just do, doing that. Yeah. It's like he literally will help pay Babe. for his own yep. contract. Yep. He's exactly. going to get paid the bag. Resign with LA, I guess, if you want. If you want to come to the Blue Jays, though, we'll also give it we'll to you. We'll also give it to you. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yes. Yeah. Yes. Yes. <laughs>